Welcome back, everybody. I'm back, y'all, with another video for you guys. So let's do a let's start off with the millennial oracle here. It's a collective read, so this is going to be for the collective. This is for all signs, okay? So take what resonates and leave what does not. So what does the collective need to know? I'm going to turn the cards so y'all can see them. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, wow. Somebody is upset because they don't feel like they fit in. Somebody is upset, feels lonely because they don't feel like they fit in. They vibe different. Maybe this could be you or someone feels like they don't fit in with your with your vibe. Tell me more. Yeah, it's like you're way too mature. So this is somebody who feels like they don't fit in with you. They feel like you're way too mature and they really bounce. They bounce. We got ghosted and bounce. Okay. So this person feels like you're extremely too mature for them. They thought that you was easy. They thought it was going to be something casual, you know, like a double standard. So they kind of like simmered it down. I see you've been doing real good online. You've been doing, like, you dominate your competition. You're succeeding at something. And it's something online. This person has been watching you, watching everything that you do. Um, But they feel like you just, you know, they've been watching you because they're trying to make sure that they can match that energy. That, like, if you post something negative, they're going to post something more negative. As long as it's negative. So they feel like you're way too mature for them. Like it's like, oh no, you you way too mature. They say they don't fit in. Yeah, they want to throw shade. They want to go back and forth, nitpick, and you know, mm -mm. y'all don't mess around. Some of y'all don't went viral. We got viral right here. Y'all don't went viral online. Wow. So this person say, yeah, you way too mature for them. This person feels like you're, oh yeah, like you're way too out of their league. And they thought you was going to be something easy, like it was going to be easy peasy. And they feel like, like you're the type that's going to try to make them sit, sit home, sit still, you know, this person like being, you know, all over the place. Some of y'all are an influencer. We got influencer and viral. Some of y'all are an influencer. Y'all have a reputation. Okay. Y'all have things going for yourself. This person does not have so much of that. This person gives this type of energy. Sorry, not sorry. They say whatever they want to say. They unremorseful. They don't care what people think. They don't care about their they don't care about what other people think about them and things of that nature. I feel like y'all have a reputation to uphold. Y'all have leveled up. And this this person here, they don't know nothing about that. They don't know nothing about that. Mm -mm. They don't know nothing about that. They know messy. That's what they know. They know bitter, miserable, angry. They know low vibrational energy.
Yeah, this person is trying to, they done moved on because they, they, um, they know that you're way out of their league. Mm -hmm. They realized that real quick. Like, it was like real quick. Yeah, see, I'm here. I thought we was feeling each other, but I guess not. So this person, you know, just deciding to, you know, let's just be friends. But or you know, this part, I feel like this person, yeah, this person, they they wasn't they wanted to play, they wanted to play. Y'all gonna end up getting tired of each other. So this person know like, let me just go on about my business. Yeah. You know, we was feeling each other, but they think feeling you means being inside of you. You get what I'm saying? Like, they don't know nothing else other than that. Yeah, that ended quick. Mm -hmm. That ended real fast. Like, before it even got started, it ended fast. This person is steady watching you. They toxic as hell. This person is extremely toxic. Could be a Capricorn. Could be a Scorpio. But this person is watching you from a distance. I'm getting wish they would have waited to kind of like get your attention. They want to try to find a way to get your attention. Because I feel like they feel like you kind of like mad at them. I'm here and can't wait that long. Okay, so, yeah, this person, they knew what time it was. They already knew. I'm here and start over, but this time, okay, four of wands. I'm here and feel like that's a bad idea. Maybe you invited this person over to your house. They, they feel like maybe it was a bad idea. Maybe you got some rules. You got rules. This person don't like the don't like rules. This person don't like rules. I'm hearing it was a bad idea. Okay, maybe y'all was supposed to link up and this person like, mm, maybe you started feeling like, nah, maybe it's not such a good idea. It's not such a good idea. You got rules. You say this person don't like rules. They they ruthless. They don't like rules. They don't like people telling them what to do. They want to come in move how they move, do what they do, and that's that. They do not like, this This is not the settle down type of energy that you're dealing with. <laughs> I'm here not coming back this time. This person may realize that you, like, yeah, like, this person feel like you think that you better, okay? <laughs> this person feel like you think that you're better than them okay but they still feel like it's, they said it's weird because they was hoping that y'all was gonna link up but it's, it's like they, they just feel like you think that you're better and I feel like you were kind of busy at the time this person may have thought that you had low self-esteem until they got to really like paying attention. Started paying attention to you. And realized like you you not that one of this that they're gonna play with. <laughs> you not that one. Why is that five of wands here? I'm seeing a bunch of people talking. Oh, they, they say, oh, you want to show out. You want to show out now. Now you want to show out. So this person really feels some type of way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they saying that y'all didn't even get a chance. It wasn't like it, it didn't even really go. It, it ended so quick before it could even get started. <laughs> this person missed their opportunity. They missed their chance. So they feel like they missed their opportunity. They missed their chance. 
Yeah. Well, they feel like maybe y'all should just be friends. And they think that they was going to regret it. Because both of y'all may be, like, real busy. Real busy all the time. I feel like maybe you was waiting for a response from this person, but you didn't get a response. I see you kind of, like, watching them, but kind of, like, not even really. Like, it's kind of like a cutoff. Because the Ten of Swords is here. So, it's a cutoff. It could be a King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. Yeah, I'm seeing you waiting on the response from them. This person really didn't want to miss their chance to be friends with you. But this person toxic. Yeah, they having regrets because they missed their they missed their chance. This person feel like they missed their chance with you. I feel like this person is going to reach out to you again. Um, they're going to try to start a conversation with you to see if you're still open to, you know, it's to see if you're still open to, you know, linking up, seeing what's up. They are going to reach out to you. Eight of Wands is communication coming in. This could be like a form of a text, DM, email. So this person is going to reach out to you. Because so they feel like, dang, I miss, maybe I missed my chance. I, I regret that. I regret that. Yeah. Ten of Wands and the Knight of Cups. I'm here and said, I ain't, I ain't talked to you in a while. I'm hearing not too many females can go back, can come back. Okay. So this masculine saying they don't really give give a lot of people their energy. But you seem like a good girl, so they want to, you know, talk to you. But, you know, <laughs> to see what you're talking about. They want to see, you know. They want to see. They want to see what you're about, but I feel like the first go around, it was like, dang, maybe I messed up. I should have, you know, gave that a chance. I missed my opportunity. But they, I feel like they're gonna come in with some type of communication. They're gonna come in with some type of communication towards you. Queen of Cups. You could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They just want to see what you want. I, I kind of get like this person kind of trying to test the waters before they make some type of move towards you, like testing the waters but they definitely do feel like dang i ain't even get a chance kind of regretting it yeah they're gonna reach out to you i'm hearing they didn't, didn't have to talk to you in a while they try to keep your attention four of pentacles and the six of wands they're gonna try to keep your attention They gonna try to come in and make it up to you. Yep. But like I said, this is not when it comes to this connection. I see they want to do things on the low. Like they they want to keep things on the low. So if that's the some type of connection that you're looking for, like a little fling, something that you do on the side, whatever, whatever. This person not for that. This is not somebody who is Prince Charming. Okay, this is not Prince Charming energy. I'm telling you right now, this this person here is, they got some real toxic ways. Okay, I'm telling you right now. But they're going to be trying to keep your attention. And they're going to reach out to you soon. They're trying to see, you know, 
if they can, if that offer, if that opportunity is still there. All right. So that's what I got, y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, and I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.